At Stewartville Middle School in southern Minnesota, students are working on a bright idea. When I first saw that light bulb turn on, I was not expecting that. I was expecting something like to explode, like the battery. A portable source of energy, small enough to be carried by hand, but with enough power to last for a week. The bigger solar panel allows the five or six uh, lights to be powered about 50 to 60 hours a week. These solar suitcase kits, part science and part service. But when they know that they're building something that matters and that's going to change lives, they suddenly become excited about what they're doing. Gigi Deco Goldman is the co-founder of We Share Solar, a nonprofit that sends these assembled kits to energy scarce regions. And over 65,000 students and teachers have participated in the We Share Solar program here in the United States. And solar suitcases that they have built have provided 14 million hours of light and charging capacity to over half a million students in sub-Saharan Africa, primarily in refugee camps. This kit likely headed to a school in rural Kenya or Uganda. After charging during the day with just a solar panel, it can be used to keep the lights on in places without reliable electricity so students can feel safer after dark. In Minnesota, about 160 kids participated in this year's program, split up into five teams. Reporters, engineers, artists, community relations, quality control. And their suitcase will now join more than 1,100 solar suitcases deployed around the world. We have a lot of things um, most people don't have in the world, and you got to feel that gratitude about that. And you also have to feel happy that you're helping them out. A group of students learning not just about the flow of electricity, but how to power positive change for others. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.